All right, guys, we got just a few seconds before the market opens again today. So just kind of focusing on AMD, Netflix, a lot of large cap stocks um, as of right now. All right, market's open. Market is open. And so far, the market's kind of trying to push down a little bit. Actually, starting to look at this penny stock ACHV right now. Nah, it's pulling back, not doing much. Okay, leave that alone. So still just kind of hanging back, not jumping in. Okay, market's starting to squeeze up a little bit. So again, I'm just kind of sitting back. I wanna see you know, what kind of direction we might get here on the marketplace. So far, the market's popped up right to the to its 50 moving average. Started started to sell off just a little bit. Okay, uh, market's starting to pop up a little bit. Still got a lot of headway above it. So you're going to hold off here for a little bit till I start seeing um, some plays forming. All right, guys, I'm in short Netflix currently. The market was rejecting off the VWAP. So I'm in short on Netflix, looking for this to roll over with the market and start breaking down a little bit. So right now, 275.39 is the pre-market support for Netflix that it would or sorry, the pre yesterday's previous low a day that would have to break through and we might get another little, little move. So market's still trying to push lower, getting bought up there quickly. Might downsize this position. I did, so I covered half my position on Netflix just to kind of play it safe here. Market still can't decide the direction. So getting ready to take the rest off. All right, so it took the rest off Netflix there. So a small $268 loss as the market kind of recovered back up over the volume weighted average price. Wow, big squeeze there on ACV. That would have been nice. A lot of sellers on it here at 590 trying to hold it down. Yeah, CGC is starting to pop up this morning. So a lot of the weed stocks are starting to do the same thing.
Okay, the market's still kind of struggling here. So Netflix is looking pretty weak here. All right. So I just hopped in uh, short on Netflix as it's starting to go break down low a day area. So it didn't get an amazing fill on that. Um, kind of missed the, the great entry there, but looks like the market's going to roll over and drop a bit. So you're going to hold this short play here on Netflix. So still short Netflix here. Yeah, there it goes. There goes Netflix breaking down. I uh, missed the take on that drop. That was my mistake. Should have took there on that drop with Netflix. Now it's going to squeeze up a little bit. So the market's still below that, that 50 moving average right now. Now it's starting to break up once again. So still holding short here on Netflix. You know, see how Netflix acts here down at this, this low area. Didn't get such a good average on the short, so I'm gonna follow it here. Might take it off just to get out with a small loss or a little bit of profit. Okay, here comes Netflix starting to roll over, breaking below the previous lows, which is good. All right, so Netflix looks pretty good to the downside still. So I'm going to hold this, not going to cover up just yet. Big buy candle there, very unexpected buy candle, buyback there on that candle. So might get ready to take Netflix off here. Not like in the way this candle got bought right back up. Still trying to hold it here. All right, so I'm all out of Netflix for another Another loss here. So down about 800 bucks on the day. I uh, had a few opportunities to take that off with the profit. Just, just basically missed those takes. Not super good there. So the market now is starting to squeeze up a little bit more. That's why I wanted to take that trade off on Netflix. So I'm going to sit back for a second, see if some plays kind of start setting up. All right, guys, watching CGC long here. All right, so I just hopped in long CGC. I'm in uh, 1,500 shares long on CGC. It uh, looks pretty bullish here, pretty strong. Market's also turning a little bit green right now. So currently holding long on CGC. This, been th this thing's been beaten down for the past, you know, week, two weeks. So I got a lot of shorts in here. You know, looking for them to hopefully keep squeezing up and 
create this nice momentum play. So CGC has got a nice curl taking place right now. Might need a little bit more time to set up before it starts moving, but I do like the way it looks here. So again, still in long on CGC, still holding right now. CGC isn't really at a previous resistance from yesterday. There's really no big resistance mark. Yesterday was just kind of like a downtrend. Really, the, the, the first resistance I really see would be coming up would probably be around 34, up maybe a little bit higher towards 34, 37, which is the 200 moving average on a five minute chart. But CGC needs to really start showing some strength to the upside here, or else I will take it off. Um, So still holding long here on CGC. There we go, CGC starting to push here. Five minute chart still pretty strong. We're trying to break over that previous high level. All right, we're starting to just uh, almost, we got up to the previous high there, trying to break through right now. There we go, starting to push up. Okay, just sold 500 shares on CGC. Just sold another 500 shares there on CGC, only holding 500 shares long now. All right, just sold basically everything on CGC. Um, still have 250 shares on CGC right now, probably just hold those, let those kind of ride out, do their thing for right now. So with that trade, that should get us back up to about break even on the day. So down about 67 bucks after that trade. So the market's up and over to 260, it's up to the 266 mark, All right? Things are starting to pick up a little bit to the upside. Going to be watching Netflix here for a long. Or do I watch AMD? Actually, I'm going to trade AMD, I believe. Uh, AMD is up pretty big, though, so a little cautious on trying to hop in there on uh, AMD. Yeah, maybe if AMD comes down, gives us a test of this previous uh, closing price first, and I could consider it. So there goes AMD pulling back, testing the previous closing price from yesterday's trading.
So AMD is still holding up. Ah, uh, missed the entry on AMD. All right, probably hold off a little bit longer here. Let the market relax. Just went through a nice move. I'm uh, going to relax on everything for a second until we get some consolidation back on the market.